you're able to be there for somebody who really can't cope. You know, you're the only hope they've got to be able to talk about their situation. Every volunteer, there must be someone we have saved. We might not know, but I think there's a good chance we have saved someone and they're in a better place than they were before. That's what you do it for, because you, you want them to go away feeling better, having connected with you in some way. After I've done a shift, I feel really useful and I feel that I've done a good job and, I've, you know, it, it means the world to me to feel that rewarded. And then it just puts your own life in perspective. There are tricky conversations. At every point, you are supported. Sometimes when you're looking around, you've just put your phone down and you know that it's time to come together and just to talk, even for 10, 15 minutes, and then go back. When I think of Samaritan, what comes to my mind is family. If I've got problems, I talk to the other Samaritan, and it's amazing to just offload. Within my friends group, I guess, I'm, I'm the listener, um, so I knew that was one of my skills. Um, I've also used the service as well myself um, previously, um, and I understand the value of being listened to. We're just all nice people who, who are interested in people and therefore are interested in each other. The range of calls we deal with as a listener, you can't really prepare for. It's very difficult to. The training came close. What the training did, it took me out of my comfort zone and put me in unfamiliar territory. I realised before this training, I didn't know how to listen. It doesn't only help in Samaritans, it helps in all walk of life. Now I'm a lot more patient. I don't jump in to try and fix things anymore because that's not what we're trained to do as Samaritans. We're just there to support and listen. I'm constantly learning, you know, I'm 56. I'm constantly learning. We want everyone to feel included. We want everyone that wants to volunteer at Samaritans to know there's no obstacles. There's such flexibility, you know, different lengths of shifts, different times. Um, so yeah, I've never found any problem with fitting my life around that. Within the branch we have listeners but we also have support volunteers so there is definitely a role for you out there if it's not listening. We are a diverse group of people, you know, join Samaritans and you'll see that there are people like you here. <laughs>